Let's wait for everybody. Hey, Mike, give us a smile. Yeah. <laughs> um, first day, first day out. So uh, excited to get back into it. The guys are very excited. So typical first day, I think. Um, you know, a lot of retention, but you don't play this game in shorts. So um, it all starts up front. You got to put pads on to see that. On the flip side of things, I want to welcome President Stanley on his first day on the job, I think, uh, is today. The new president of the university here, so look forward to his leadership. Um, and I'll take some questions. The left side of the offensive line, Mark, uh, we saw Tyler, I believe, and you mentioned in media day that he might not be ready to go at the start. I'm just curious about the state of the left side there. Yeah, you know, he'll, he'll get back in probably in a week or so. Um, he's, he just uh, gradually pushing back through the office surgery. About any depth chart changes from the end of spring till today? Uh, probably not. You know, it's pretty much like it was in the spring coming out. What we try to do is, is really work everybody. Everybody got work. You know, so we work four groups, two spot different drills, so we've got different guys working. So everybody got reps, and we'll start making looks. Look at people as they move forward. Julian, wide receiver. Is that full time thing, or is he kind of dabbling right You know, he's worked, at, uh, he's worked in the secondary uh, through our summer drills and everything and just want to make sure because of uh, you know because we're down a wide receiver we want to make sure that he's got an opportunity to have the right numbers. He's got uh, you know great hands. He's been a wide receiver, he's an exceptional playmaker. And uh, so we just want to start him here and soak him in wide receiver and then we'll see where we go. Conditioning tests, how can they go mark anybody now? Yeah, yeah, very good. Very good. Mark, how do you sense the hunger level is coming off everything you went off of last year with this team? Uh, very good. You know, I think every every year is a new year for every every program out there. Can you remain consistent? And really, can you sustain? Can you go through the problems that you have, whether it's injuries or or losing a tight game? Can you push through those things? That's that's really what I think uh, defines you. So, um, but I think you know, like I've said it all along, ever since spring, and I said it media day. I'm very extremely impressed in terms of how our players are handling things, going about their business, and leading. Do you think that chip on the shoulder is pretty strong, or do you think that's a little too much to talk about? You guys, you guys need a story. <laughs> well, we do. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it always exists. You know, for everybody, every player has a chip. Back this may be the easiest I've seen it's ever been. <laughs> Back to the left side is uh, we saw Campbell, I believe, in place of Tyler at left guard. Are there any other names there? And also, you know, Akira we're going to work. Yeah, as, as far as our offensive line, we're working everybody different positions and moving people around. So, you know, we're not ready to say who's where, but we, you know, we've got guys that have played both sides of the ball, I mean, both sides of the line. We've got guys that play guard, guys that play tackle. So, uh, right now, it's about getting their feet up back up underneath them and just. Uh, you know, getting a starting point. When you and, have and that line like that, that, that has guys with a number of starting experience in a number of different spots, when you come into a camp like that, does that increase the competition or does that make guys maybe tighten up a little bit? No, I think it increases the competition. We've got a lot of guys who've played and uh, got to play a little better. But we've got a lot of guys who've played and I think that they're, they're, they're sort of uh, committed to having a, a great year. Know that you won't discuss short-term injuries, but you will when they're long-term. Is there anybody that's a long-term mark? No long-term injuries. Everybody's in. One freshman I don't think we saw was Trayvon Morgan. Is he uh, here? Uh, Trav, we expect or? Trayvon to be here very shortly. You know, he's finishing up some things academically. We expect to see. Is there anybody else that you guys want to see right now? Or? Uh, no. Is he about a veteran of the group as you remember having as far as, you know, the combined experience on both sides of the ball where you really, for the most part, know what you got from back from last year at 17 starting? Yeah, we've got guys back. I, I, I don't know the numbers. Is it the most experienced? But we've got a lot of guys back. And uh, like I said, retention that everybody has has is, is been impressive. But that's usually the case on the first day of shorts. You know, we've sort of got to get through it. And, you know, everybody start to square one today with whatever they're at in the front. What's the day? What's this? I can't remember the schedule. When you can you put on shells and when you go full pads? We'll be shorts tomorrow, shells on uh, Saturday and Monday, and then pads on, on Tuesday. On a day like this, when you've been around a dozen years, do you get excited on day one? Yeah, I'm always I'm always looking forward to the next step and uh, watching our guys, especially our young guys. I like going down and watching our freshmen, you know, play with the football, you know, which we haven't been able to do. We've watched them move around and things like that. So. It's a starting point, like I said, you know, but you know, you play this game in pads, as I said earlier, and you play from the ground up. So guys look good, guys catching the ball, throwing the ball, that kind of stuff. But, you know, it's a different game. Later tonight, Mark, you'll call your coach's wife and just like you, your tradition. I'm curious with your tree, do you have any of your former players that'll call you on their first day? Well, that's a good question. I don't know. Let's see. Let everybody know.
first scrimmage mark would that be a week from Saturday or is that um, too far to I think uh, I can't remember it's, it might it's it's Friday Friday of yeah. next week okay It was in shorts. That was my first impression. You know, it's, it's hard to you know it's hard to stay. You know, we tell our, our guys to tag off on them, tag their hip, and let them run. So I think he had 300 yards rushing. Good guys. Thank you. Thanks, Mike.